Hi friends, we're gonna do some science activity here. We're gonna do some frozen baking soda um, containers and then we're gonna find out what's inside. So to make the frozen baking soda part, just have regular baking soda. And I'm gonna take one cup of baking soda. So I'm gonna use this big measuring cup and I'm just gonna pour it in the bowl. And parents, this is not an exact science, so you can, this is just how, this is just a starting point. So just regular old baking soda. And I have a cup and I'm just gonna pour it in there. And then I have um, about a half a cup of water, but I'm gonna just start by pouring in about half of that. And you can see that it's getting a little, I'm just gonna mix it up. Here, do you feel like we're cooking here? Cooking with Mrs. Q, that sounds like a good, maybe that should be our next segment. It's a little dry, um, so I will add a little bit more water. But you don't need to, you can, it can just be, it doesn't have to be goopy. It can be um, a little bit dry on the dry side if you want. Because you just need enough water to make it um, kind of hang together so you can freeze it. All right, so that's well, probably a little bit too goopy, but like I said, it's not an exact science, so it's really, that's fine. Okay, so then I'm going to use some containers I found around the house. Of course, the kids know that I always have these yogurt containers. Um, so I'm just going to scoop a little bit in, in the bottom. And then today I'm going to hide some dice in my thing. So I have a the, goop, the baking soda mixture in the water, and then I'm going to just cover that up a little bit with this other, with a little bit more mixture. So then it looks like that. So families, you can... Um, hide whatever you want. You can your kids can do it with you, or you can hide some do somewhere they don't know what's inside. Either way, um, another fun thing to do would be to add some food coloring. I think I did. If you want to do that, I mean you can. You don't have to, but it's always just fun. Just drizzle a little bit. Mix, mix, mix. See, fun. Fun wildness, right? So I'll put that in there, throw my dice in there, cover it up, flick a little uh, baking soda and water mixture on the counter, and then I'm going to just put that in the freezer. Now, a couple hours overnight. I did mine other ones overnight. So kids, just so you know, I didn't. it doesn't freeze right away. I already made some, and I have some right here that I'm going to pop out of my containers. Oops, but I really meant to have this. Okay, I just had to take a little pauser. So these come out of their plastic containers really easily. I have, um, just kind of squeeze it and it pops out and it makes this nice frozen pod. Um, I already made some with, with some food coloring. I made a purple one. So I think that's probably enough. Then... I'm going to use the same container that I had. I have some vinegar, just regular old white vinegar. I suppose you could use fancy vinegar, but um, you could use this. And then I have one of these little pipettes, but if you have a turkey baster, you could use that, or you could use a spray bottle. And I'm just going to squeeze some um, vinegar into my pie plate, and then let's see if we can... Nope, that's too close. Okay, I'm going to flip this around. 